and it's kitchen and it's pancake day coming up so I'm going to show you how to make American pancakes. The equipment you are going to need is a frying pan but I'm going to use a hot plate because I want to show you what the bubbles look like okay but a frying pan would be absolutely brilliant. You just need a bowl to mix your mixture in, you need a whisk, you need a flipper you know to turn over the pancakes and I always like a plastic spatula just so I don't waste any of the ingredients. Okay, the ingredients you're going to need, 225 grams of plain flour, you're going to need one tablespoon of baking powder, 30 grams of melted butter, a pinch of salt, a pinch of sugar and 300 ml of milk. Right, let's get to it. I've added the salt, pinch of salt and a pinch of sugar into the bowl with the flour. I'm now going to add, now a tablespoon of baking powder is three teaspoons. So I can't fit a tablespoon in here, so I'm going to use three teaspoons. Okay, I'm going to mix that around and I'm going to add the eggs. So I make a little well in the middle. I never beat the eggs first, it doesn't matter. In they go. Okay, now I'm going to add melted butter. a well and then we'll just add the flour. So I'm just going to mix it a little bit so you can see the flour is not going oof, everywhere, okay? And I'm gradually bringing in the flour from the outside and now I can start adding my milk. But not all at once because you don't want it to get lumpy and you don't want the flour to go oof. Okay, there we are. Mix that in. Right, I'll add everything in and I'll give it a good whisk until it's lovely and smooth. Look at that, really lovely and smooth. So a nice thick batter. Okay, and now, because we've got the measuring jug, I'm going to pour the batter into the measuring jug. It makes it so much easier to pour. Okay, now we'll leave this for about 10 minutes just to help the um, bubbles and the warmth warm up so that you get a nice thicker fluffier pancake. Right, your frying pan. So you need it on um, about medium heat and I put a little bit of butter and I'm going to put a little bit of oil. Because I'm not using a frying pan I'm going to need something to just stop it from sticking so I'm just going to move it round. There we are. Right, and now because we put this in the jug you can pour it straight in. And we're going to let this cook until you start seeing little bubbles on the top. So this will cook for about two or three minutes and we'll look for the little bubbles. You see how nice it's puffed up and you can see the little bubbles? So if we turn this over, look at that, and you can see already that it's rising up. If you're not sure, you can just do a little peep and see if it looks brown underneath. If it's not brown, don't turn it over. There we are. Look at that. Can you see how it's puffing up? Okay, let's see if they're cooked. So we'll just peel it off and just lift it. Look, perfect. I like always serving them the way that you flip them. So I have one two, three, look at that, that looks amazing. We'll put some more mixture on. Ready for the next ones? If you need to put a little bit of butter or a little bit of oil on, just put a teaspoon on and move it around the pan and it will stop it sticking. As your mixture warms up, the bigger the bubbles will be. That's why I always think it's nice to leave it for 10 minutes or so. Okay, finish our pancakes off. You need good old fashioned bananas. So let's peel this. Maple syrup. There we are. American pancakes.